I know, I know. But we have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? When is this thing happening? Are we sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to. Hola, ¿qué tal? Soy Chips y estamos en The Wolf Among Us con Silkeka. Hola, chicos. Y vamos a ver qué es lo que ha pasado aquí. ¿Qué es lo que va a pasar? Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble at the crooked man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. What happened? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know. ¿Qué salías de una pieza? I'm just glad you made it back in one piece. <laughs> <laughs> It's about time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes, what are you waiting for? You killed Lily. She was my sister. How could you? What do you have to say for yourself? Where the yourself? fuck do you get Those off? You think you have the right And to just do Faith? this to people? You're a fucking crook. This. You should fucking be ashamed. Shithole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder As of I Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, Ese aren't ya está you? Muerto. Yeah, sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel Mesh, now? Te, te va a is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. I killed him. He's dead. He's what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. There's no That need doesn't for change this. anything. We'll deal with it later, but right now you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case you still have a lot to answer for. And I was told I, don't... I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? Let her finish. Then you can have your say. Got it? If you know about this. You are charged with the murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence against various members of the Fable Town community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. <laughs> <Yeah>. Aiding <laughs> and providing monetary <laughs> support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And resisting arrest. Oh, yes. <laughs> Now, is there anything you would like to say? <clears throat> First of all, I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily. So you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Second, like hell you Stop didn't. the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. And there's all the other crap he's done. Se lo vamos a tirar, pero dejarlo hablar. If you wanted a chance to talk, we'll go ahead. What? We all know he's guilty. What the fuck does he need to speak for? The crooked man has committed crimes against this government and, most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death, upon which your body will be committed to the witching Where ground. it fucking belongs! That's so right. let's get on with it then. But we promised you a chance to defend yourself, and I won't rob you of that right. What the you fuck? Really what is about talk? justice? If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap judgments, no more secrets. We are going to treat everyone fairly. Even when they don't deserve it. Bien dicho. This is ridiculous. You have the floor. Thank you, Miss White. Yo también lo pienso. Georgie, I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you going to get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. 
I had nothing to do with Tell it. This is such bullshit. Bullshit. You've you always been a bit of a powder keg. If you were so offended by it, why'd you cover it up then? If it had nothing to do with you and your shit, then why'd you try to protect him for so what long? What cover up? I never made any attempt to hide Georgie's criminal activity from you. I learned of it myself for only fuck's recently. Sake. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? No, realmente no. Please. Tell them, Big B. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? Helpful isn't the word I would use. My comrades are another matter. And I'm sorry for the predicament they put you in. They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me, as I've protected them. ¿Cómo está? You understand wanting to protect what está you do, don't you? A la peña, eh? You'd do anything. No. You might even give up an innocent man, just to save someone. La audiencia está considerándolo. Ellos no querían ¿Es going somewhere? Straight to the point, I see. You'll make a fine deputy mayor. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that, hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. What about Lily? She wasn't free. She wasn't given a choice. Do you really think she wanted that any of those girls wanted their lives like that? I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry that your sister asked me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my better judgment to give her a distasteful job. Pero right, Dios, and you solo son palabras. So they couldn't leave. Yeah, that's what you did to us. How you kept us all you in line. You forget it was not me who put you in that position. Come on, you all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. When your government abandoned you, left you poor and helpless, sniveling on street corners, I was there to look out for you. Está liando, eh? Pero mazo. Yeah, wasn't I? No pongas esto en nuestra contra. You're the fucking problem here, not us. Really? What about Auntie Greenleaf? Her story is not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homelands. Everything that matters, anyway. With nowhere else to turn, she came to me for help. And what did I do for you? You got my tree back. I got her tree back. And in turn, we used her magic to help poor Fables get glamours. Because I helped her, she was able to make a living, provide for herself. And what did they do? She wanted my tree destroyed, but Bigby refused. What? You were gonna burn her tree? Ella no tiene la culpa. She had her reasons. Greenleaf was using her magic to help Crane and the Crooked Man. That's why Snow wanted your tree burned. That's not why. It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, Hola. and you being too soft to notice what he'd do to get it. It had nothing to do with a crooked man. We've made some mistakes. I've made some mistakes. But believe me, I truly want what's best for this town. And that may not always be clear right away. But I want you all to know that I care deeply about all of you. And so does the sheriff. Pues sí, la verdad que sí. Yeah, right. I can't promise you perfection. No one can. Things haven't been great for a while now, but we'll do better at protecting you from people like him. The crooked man's been exploiting you, exploiting your hope for a better life. You would go to him for help, and he would take that weakness and add it to his strength. Él nunca se Do you really think the crooked man cared about you? He just cared about your money. He cares about your obedience. Claro, Pauline, esos metían trampas. They're right. You're all still afraid of him, even now. But you needn't be. His contamination of this town is over, and those girls will have their justice. Ahí está. Lo hicimos bien, lo hicimos bien. Ah, el pocito, macho tem. Very good, very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White, but it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely unfounded. The sheriff simply doesn't have a particle of evidence Uy. linking me to the. Georgie was working for you. Bigby got a confession. A confession that, that nobody heard. Now, I'm no barrister. 
But I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke. Especially given Bigby's history. What are oh. you talking about? Snow? You won't be able to talk your way out of this, crooked man. What do you mean there's no evidence? Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. I just of course no, it's right. Right. This man tormented all of you for profit. Georgie Let killed him. Let me just him. make sure I understand you. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did because he was working for me at the time. Yes? Yes. Of course. Sí, tú eres responsable. Yes. You're responsible. If I'm to blame for Georgie's mal puesto, mistakes, ¿sabes? shouldn't Miss White be held accountable for Bigby's actions as well? Like what? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under my watch? Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that go? You can't be serious. Snow had nothing to do with it. We all thought she was dead. Besides, Correcto. Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's Capullo. enough. So, you won't answer for your employee's behavior, but I must perish for This mine. is completely different. We I all... did not order those two girls dead. It simply never happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. This is right. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Listen, I everyone calm down. This isn't I the mean, reason a certain we're level here. of privilege should be afforded to who? This is how it's always been. This is what I'm talking about. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world. And ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Do no. Who was there while they idly played in their towers, judging you? Treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny. Without me, who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? Who will dare challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? Who will protect you from the big bad wolf? Who will be the... No soy grande y malo. Miss White! Ah, ya está libre del hechizo. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath? What's wonder. she doing here? Ya está libre de leche, like so ya puedo I decirlo. I need to say something. We're kind of Adelante. in the middle of something. Bluebeard. She has something to say, and we're gonna listen. Go right ahead. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut up. You enslaved us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. <sighs> but you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Aha! Uh -huh. Did you kill her? Did he? No. Sheriff, sure, this is highly you... irregular. Vivian killed herself back at the pudding and pie. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I'm. Nerissa! Know. My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be just. He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Oh Faith my and yeah. Lily are dead because of you. The confirma. only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And this just confirms it. He made Georgie do it. It was the him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say so. Ever. You're going to take the word of a stupid... At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Did you now? Ha <laughs> ha. Like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Good enough for me. Me too. So that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Venga, dale. No, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's got to pay for what he oh, did. Okay, Listen to lovely. yourselves. You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. 
What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't let you go free after this. Uh -huh. I could always rip your arms off first. Would you enjoy that? Well done, then. Now, for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. No, we can le imprison him. Pozo. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. Eso no funciona How can tan we be bien. sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I assure not good you, enough. Maybe he'll be if he isn't stopped. I don't get shot so we get rid of him. It's too dangerous. We can send everyone. Listen up! Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment, so I think this we... This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Oh. I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. Deberíamos votar. We should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should oh. be the judge. Ostras, that makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are you sure? This isn't how it's... It's what the people want, Miss White. Okay. Whoa. Wolf, it's your call. Oh. Snow. Just do what you think is right. Me acaban de dejar con toda la mierda encima, eh. Yo le tiraría al pozo. ¿Qué le hago? ¿Qué le hago? ¿Qué le hago? Rápido? La cabeza no. La cabeza no. Vale, encerrarlo. ¿La encerramos o le tiramos al pozo? ¡Eh, hijo de perra! Al pozo, ya al pozo, eh. No al pozo yo no me voy. Venga, dale. ¡Hala! Te arranco la cabeza y la tiro al pozo. Encerrar, encarcelado, porque es lo que quiere. Hola. Es lo que quiere. Te voy a encerrar. Por listo. You said you had a way to keep him from hurting people. Wait, you That's can't be serious. What he's done? You're just gonna put him in prison? This isn't the way, sheriff. You're doing the right thing. Yes, there's a way. Por lo encerraremos. All right, do it. Lo, al, al aunque sea cabo, lo emparedamos Al fin y al cabo es una manera de hacerle sufrir Porque va a estar sí. encerrado toda su vida Más que matarle directamente Es que tú también lo has visto, ¿no? Que quería morir Sí Vale, chicos, la traducción parece que ha vuelto loco el final del capítulo 5 Así que le vamos a dar a continuar Y se va a ver en inglés, ¿vale? Intentaremos traducir Sí, vamos a hacer una traducción aproximada Pero no prometemos nada Porque esto nos deja con... Hay que responder rápido y todo eso Entonces pues no podremos hacerlo muy rápido Lo de traducir, a veces no traduciremos Bueno, que, que hagáis uso de lo que aprendéis en clase Dale, venga Y quiero saber qué ha pasado Ya estamos en el final, leño yeah. Apartamentos... Sí, apartamentos Un día después Un día después Te duele el ojito Ahí te clavaron una, una esta del espejo Madre mía, chaval, cuánto fuma este, ¿no? Bueno, no se mueren. Un cuervo. ¿Lo ha convertido en cuervo? ¿Lo ha convertido en cuervo? No era lo que, no era lo que esperaba. Man. Buenos días, Crooked Man. Tiene una lengua afilada. Pensé que sería mejor para cualquiera si, si fuera con ella. Hey, <risa> Sheriff. Mm. Hola, Sheriff. No sé si me recuerdas. Sé quién eres, Papa Moscas. Has trabajado en, en, aquí, pero... Quiere que vea el camión. Dice que estará ahí en un minuto. Este tío es muy... Este tío es bueno, ¿sabes? Es buena gente. ¿Y estos quiénes son? Pues... <risa> Gente de sí, la Jack y, y demás. Mira, el pequeño Tim. ¿Te acuerdas? Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf. oh señor Robo. Papá Mosca se dejó las llaves. Um, ¿Qué le decimos? Okay. ¿Podemos hablar? Ya, ya sé que tienes que, que ocuparte we'll de esto. Later, okay? Hablaremos más tarde, ¿ok? Eso es lo que me ha dicho. Oh, barba azul. Good morning, Miss White. Uh. Bueno, al menos tenía una cita. 
Pues nada, ahora habrá que esperar al ascensor. ¿Qué hay ahí? No hay nada. Lo han hecho de tal manera que han dejado ahí... Desde brillo. abajo, ¿tú crees que pasa algo? Uf, no sé. Esto es como el epílogo, ¿no? Tienen que dejar esto abierto. No, la historia ya se tiene que cerrar, supongo. Siempre hay segundas partes. <risa> o segundas temporadas. Hombre, esta es la primera. Oh, mira, el señor Toad se pira con, con TJ. ¿El dinero? ¿Qué le dimos? No lo sé, se lo habrá fundido en... En putis. Ah, bueno, que ahí las tienes que ha estado muy ocupado y que se le han olvidado. Muy buenos días, Sheriff. Putos buenos días. Lo siento, traté de ayudarte. Lo siento, traté de ayudarte. Y te di un montón de dinero. Entonces, ¿por qué me tenía que mandar a mí y a mi niño? Me prometiste que tendría otra oportunidad, pero la señora Blanca dijo que tenía que ir a la granja igualmente. Le dije que tenía el dinero, pero no quiso oírlo. Pues espero que lo esté traduciendo bien. Vamos, Colin. Ya voy, tranquilo. ¿Qué pasa, jamoncitos? Oh, ya no me tiene miedo. Espera, señores, es comisario Bigby. Sabes que estuvo llorando toda la noche el pobre niño. ¿Puedes darle esto a la señora Blanca? Por fin. Papá dice que no hay tiempo para decir adiós, así que. ¿Qué es? Sí, le voy a decir que sí, punto. Ah, es uno de los bichitos que tenía. Es un Willow Beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, cause when they're little, they have these pouches that squirt juice. Por eso te dice que cuando son pequeñitos que tienen no sé qué cosas y que luego tal. She said it was pretty. Ella dijo que era bonito. Oh. That's everybody. Eso son todos. Esa gorra es muy rara. ¿Cómo es la granja? He oído que los ogros viven ahí y que comen gente mientras duermen a veces. Dios, espero que no. Tenemos que ir. Me quiero quedar aquí. Lo siento mucho, TJ. Pero mira por el lado bueno. Hay un montón de sitio para correr y, y un buen río cerca para que puedas nadar todo lo que quieras. Incluso de día, sí. No tienes que preocuparte sobre los mundanos viéndote. Estará bien. Vamos, no, está, no será tan malo. ¿Has estado allí alguna vez? No, eh, alguno de esos animales no están tranquilos cerca de, de Lowe's. Así que no, no lo sabías, ¿eh? Bueno, ya estamos preparados. Adiós, señor Lobo. Adiós, TJ. Colin. ¿Qué le decimos a Colin? ¿Encendemos un cigarrillo? Recuerdo que él fumaba. Sí, dáselo. Ay, Dios mío. ¿Sigues, ¿Sigues mal conmigo? ¿Cambiaría tu opinión? ¿Tienes alguno más de esos? Te voy a dar todo el, todo el, la cajetilla. Gracias, Bigby. Siempre un caballero, ¿eh, Bigby? Supongo que te veré por ahí. Mantente lejos de problemas. Si es que puedes. Intentaré. I'll try. Lo intentaré. Sí, yo también. Jo, qué penita. Diciendo adiós. Uh, hola, sirenita. Y Blanca, ¿por qué les he hecho si tenían dinero? No sé, se la dan por las normas. Está siendo muy dura. También está súper cargada de mierda. Hola, hola. ¿Sigues llevando oh. esa cosa? Oh, sí. Yeah. Tiene miedo. Supongo que sí. No es fácil olvidarlo. Mm. Necesitas let it go. Let it go. ¿Cómo vas a pasar página si no? Ya sé que estás intentando ayudar, Bigby, pero esto solo es una cosa que tengo que hacer por mí misma. Escucha, vine aquí porque quería contarte algo. 
Bueno, decirte algo. Es sobre lo que le pasó a Faye, a Faye y a Lily. No estoy segura de cómo de por dónde empezar. Faith, Faith, Lily y yo teníamos este plan. Y vamos a encontrar una manera de, de irnos, de abandonar el Pudding and Pie. Pero Faith decidió conseguir algo de leverage. No sé qué es leverage. Robó una, una foto de. Vale. Voy a contarlo, ¿vale? Vale, que Faith hizo la foto y la robó. Y entonces ya se descubrió toda la trama y entonces se metieron en esos problemas. Es lo que hiciste, Nerissa. Me volví loca, ¿vale? Pensé que si... Entonces, ¿qué pasó? Le dijo todo al, al Cruzman y, y suplicó por, por piedad por todas. Ay, estabas intentando protegerlas. La cagó, ¿vale? Pero fue porque fue tonta. No supo cómo hacerlo. Georgie prometió que lo, lo haría todo más suave y tal y cual. Oh, Dios mío. No quiere que la toques. Nerissa se dio cuenta. No lo entiendo. Ha sido algo muy... Ha sido muy, muy contrario, ¿no? No sé qué es lo que pasó, pero esta noche en, la, en el club, Georgie volvió y me dijo que las cosas habían cambiado. Tuvo que hacer un, ej un ejemplo de nosotras. Y mientras dos de nosotras estuvieran... ¿Cómo? Que Georgie se la cargó delante suya. Sé lo que dije. Pero no era la verdad. Ah, Dios mío. Bueno, que ella sabe que fue el Crookman el que lo hizo. Esa noche después, después de Faith Intenté advertir a Lily Pero ella no estaba con su, con su asignación programada Así que hice la única cosa que pude hacer Dejé la cabeza de Faith en, tu, en, tus, en tus escaleras Así que ese trozo de... Ahí está ya la respuesta a lo claro. que yo te dije antes. Sí. <risa> Se cortó la pierna intentando subir la, la esta. Sí, ella fue la que lo empezó todo. Dice, gente como nosotros se quedan caen en el olvido todo el rato. Cuando sufrimos lo hacemos en silencio. Y al mundo le gusta de esta manera. Simplemente nos desvanecemos, como si nunca existiese, como si nunca hubiéramos existido. Eso no volverá a pasar. Las cosas van a ser diferentes, lo prometo. Cosas como esa no volverán a pasar. No mientras yo siga por aquí. Tú harás las cosas bien, tú y Snow White. No sé, las cosas no sé. Dice que da igual la manera que él intenta hacer las cosas, que siempre le sale mal. Dice que ellos, ellos le necesitan. A él y a, y a Snow. Le voy a decir que, que Snow, Snow no me necesita. Dice, estoy segura de que no es verdad. Después de todo lo que has hecho por nosotros, a lo mejor no queremos admitirlo, pero sin ti nada de esto habría pasado. Tú escuchaste cuando nadie, cuando nadie más lo hizo. Supiste cuándo mostrar eh, piedad y trajiste justicia a, esta, a este pueblo al final. Porque al final trajiste al Cruxman y todo el mundo tal. Estoy perdiéndome mazo haciendo la traducción. Vamos, que hiciste lo correcto. Que te dieron este trabajo por una razón. Espero haber hecho algo bien. 
You've changed this place. Has cambiado este sitio para bien o para mal. Fable Town no será lo mismo con sin no sería lo mismo sin ti. Pero no te vayas. Quédate, hay sitio en mi nevera. No eres tan malo como todo el mundo dice que eres. Eso es lo que le dijo Faith. Es verdad. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. Esa es Faith Le quitó la piel Detrás de ella Te volveré a ver, Wolf no, no lo he pillado. Oh, Dios mío, que, que Faith es ella. Es ella. ¿Cómo, cómo, 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 cómo? No sé, hay algo muy raro. A lo mejor sale en la segunda temporada o algo de eso, pero no sé, tengo que pensarlo, ¿vale? Está todo demasiado descolocado. Oh, Dios mío, algo ha pasado. ¿No te acuerdas? Es que le dice las mismas palabras y le habla y... No lo entiendes. Pero en la cabeza... Sería glamour. ¿Y por qué una puti se va a tener que tomar glamour para parecerse a otra puti? Para engañar. Hay algo detrás de esto. No sé. No lo sé, pero bueno. Puf. ¿Qué es lo que le hiciste a Georgie? El 68% de los jugadores mataron a Georgie. Uh -huh. Y nosotros también. Le dimos al este un juicio. El 90% de la gente le trajo, le trajo vido. Sí, pero el 47% le... <risas> el 47% le eligió eh, meter en la prisión. Sí, pero que enfrío, que más gente decidió tirarle. Mira, casi todo el mundo aceptó el, el regalo de TJ. Oh, ¿Cómo alguien no puede aceptarlo? Pues a, hay un 1,5% de gente que no lo hizo. No merecéis vivir. <risas> Será gente que está jugando ahí en plan de malas, ¿no? no bueno, sé. ¿cuáles fueron tus últimas palabras a Nerisa? Tú y el 54% de los jugadores dijo, espero haber hecho algo bueno aquí. Pero es que esa no tiene que ser Nerisa. Esa tiene que ser Faith. Luego analizamos bien lo que No lo sé, tengo, tengo que echar un vistazo. Pues nada, chicos, eso ha sido toda la primera temporada. Sí, que sacarán más, seguramente. Aquí están, fíjate. Todo lo que hemos hecho, ¿no? Las estadísticas especiales. Bueno, esto ya lo echaré un vistazo. Porque. Ahí pone que es, están inter muertos. es interesante, sí, claro. Georgie y. Georgie y Faith. Sí. Pero no lo sé, porque se ha quedado abierto. Sí, sí, Dios, sí. Dios. Bueno, pues nada, que nos vemos. <risa> que nos vemos y leer los cómics y esperemos a la segunda temporada y espero que os haya gustado mucho esta serie la verdad por favor dar like que comentar y vuestras teorías conspiratorias también esto dios mío me ha encantado la historia sí a mí también oh, nos vemos adiós hasta luego oh dios mío this choice is blank ah ¿Qué pasa aquí? ¿Qué ha pasado aquí? Ah, no veo nada. ¿Qué pasa? Ah. Dicho es blanco. No lo entiendo. Ni siquiera se escucha nada, ¿no? Sí, es como que se ha quedado esto, esto mal. La traducción debe de haber sido. Ups. Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you, all fixed up. What? No estamos volviendo atrás. ¿Qué ha pasado? No lo entiendo, Keka. Yo tampoco. ¿Qué ha pasado? Está bugueado. No, no, a lo mejor es un recuerdo. ¿Tú crees? Sí, mira, se metió, eh. ¿Qué es eso? A lo mejor está enseñando lo que hubiera pasado si... Pues está esto... Esto es muy raro. ¿Has visto que no hay ni personajes ni nada? No entiendo. ¿Y tienes que atacar a la puerta? ¿Qué ha pasado? No lo entiendo. 
Mira una cabeza sin renderizar, no sin ojos ni nada. <risa> mira. Ay, qué ca. Ay, qué ca. Mira, ha pasado, pero mira, si no hay ni paredes. ¿Qué ha pasado? ¿Qué ha pasado aquí? Mira, 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 con la cabeza quitada y todo. ¿Qué es esto? Esto es una pesadilla. ¿Qué hago yo ahora? Correcto. Correcto. Bien dicho. This is ridiculous. You have the floor. Algo gordo va a pasar. Thank you, Miss White. Yo también lo pienso. Georgie. I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you going to get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes, but he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business, and for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with it. This is such bullshit! He's always been a bit of a powder keg. If you were so offended by it, why'd you... ...schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder As of I Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, Ese aren't ya está you? Muerto. Yeah, sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel Best now? Te, te va a is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. I killed him. He's dead. He's... what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. There's no That doesn't change this. anything. We'll deal with it later, but right now you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. And I was I told don't... I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? Let her finish. Then you can have your say. Got it? If you no <clears throat> You are char I know, I know. But we have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? When is this thing happening? Are we sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to... Hola, ¿qué tal? Soy Chips y estamos en The Wolf Among Us con Silkeka. Hola, chicos. Y vamos a ver qué es lo que ha pasado aquí. ¿Qué es lo que va a pasar? Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble at the crooked man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. What happened? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know. ¿Qué salías de una pieza? I'm just Glad you made it back in one piece. <laughs> It's about time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes, what are you waiting for? You killed Lily. She was my sister. How could you? What do you have to say for Where yourself? the fuck do you get These off? You think you have the right and to just do this to people? You're a fucking crook. This. You should fucking be ashamed. Shithole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd charged with the murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence against various members of the Fabletown community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. <laughs> yeah. Aiding and providing <laughs> monetary capullo, eh? support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And resisting arrest. Oh, yes. <laughs> Now, is there anything you would like to say? <clears throat> First of all, 
I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily, so you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Second. Like hell you Stop didn't. Stop the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. And there's all the other crap he's done. Se lo vamos a tirar, pero dejarla hablar. If you wanted a chance to talk, we'll go ahead. What? We all know he's guilty. What the fuck does he need to speak for? The crooked man has committed crimes against this government and, most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death, upon which your body will be committed to the witching Where ground. Where it fucking cover it up, then? If it had nothing to do with you and your shit, then why'd you try to protect him for so what long? What cover up? I never made any attempt to hide Georgie's criminal activity from you. I learned of it myself For only recently. For sake. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? No, realmente Ali, no. Please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? Helpful isn't the word I would use. My comrades are another matter. And I'm sorry for the predicament they put you in. They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me, as I've protected them. ¿Cómo está? You understand wanting to protect what está you can, a, don't you? A la peña, eh? You'd do anything. No. You might even give up an innocent man, just to save someone. La audiencia está considerándolo. What are you talking about? Ellos no Is this going somewhere? Straight to the point, I see. You'll make a fine deputy mayor. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that, hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. 